you know, your personality creates your personal reality. That's it. And your personality is made up of how you think, how you act, and how you feel. So if you keep thinking the same way, you keep acting the same way, you keep feeling the same way, everything stays the same in your life because nothing changes in your life until you change, right? Mm -hmm. So turns out if you keep thinking the same way, making the same choices, doing the same things, creating the same experiences and feeling the same emotions or responding to your life in the exact same way, um, you keep doing that, your biology tends to get more rigid. Uh, we fire and wire the same circuits, we hardwire our brain and they, it only takes a small stimulation or a small thought or a response to someone or something. And like a sequence of thoughts, it's, it just turns on automatically. So, so your biology, your, your neurochemistry, your neurohormones, your genes, your, everything stays the same because you're the same. So crisis and trauma is always the thing that gets a person to really start looking at how do I really change, right? So, so we want to tell people, let's not wait for that. Mm -hmm. let's, let's learn and change in a state of growth and inspiration. So, so if you keep doing those same things over and over again, the middle life period, we, we become very, very programmable. So, in order for us to change, we have to become conscious of how we think. We have to become really aware of how we behave, what our habits are, even how we speak. Now, this is a tough one. We have to really look at the emotions that we live by every single day and, and say, wow, this, this actually could be unworthiness. Uh, this could actually be guilt. But if you're too busy with your cell phone and your social media and you're too busy with your kids and running around and your environment can distract you from these feelings. So my interest is to get people to retreat from their lives, right? Just for five, seven days and, and remove the constant stimulation in their external environment that reminds them of who they think they are as a personality to separate themselves from the people they know and the places they go and the things they do at the exact same time. And then fill their brain with knowledge and information and then remind them that they're actually creating their life. 